Hello children, today we will be learning about addition without carrying over. You have already learned how to add two numbers. Now let us revise it. 2 plus 3 is equals to 5. Now, let's see an example. Tony has three purses each, containing 100 beats. Sonu has 5 purses. So, how many purses all together? Yes, 3 plus 5 is equals to 8 purses. How many beats all together in the purses with Tony and Sonu? Well, 300 plus 500 is equal to 800 beats. Now, we will see other example. If Tony has 200 rupee notes, 110 rupee notes and 5 1 rupee coins, and Sonu has 100 notes, 310 rupee notes, and 2 1 rupee coins. How many 100 rupee notes do they have all together? Let us find out. Tony has 200 rupee notes, and Sonu has 100 notes. Which means, 2 plus 1 equals 3, that is, there are total 300 notes. How many 10 rupee notes, do they have all together? Let us count, Tony has 1 rupee note and Sonu has 3 10 rupee notes. So, 1 plus 3 is equal to 4, that is, there are total 4 10 rupee notes. How many 1 rupee notes do they have all together? Let us count the 1 rupee coin. Tony has 5 1 rupee coins. Sonu has 2 1 rupee coins. So, 5 plus 2 is equal to 7. Total there are 7 1 rupee coins all together. Which means, there are 300 notes, 4 10 rupee notes, and 7 1 rupee coins all together. Carry out and observe the following additions. 54 plus 20. We will begin this addition from the unit's place. 4 plus 0 is 4. Now, 10's place. 5 plus 2 is 7. So the answer is 74. Now we will see the next example. 70 plus 8. Now we begin the addition from the unit's place. 0 plus 8 is 8. Now, from the tens place, we have only 7, so we write, 7 as it is. So, the answer is 78. Add, 376 plus 2. Well, if you arrange them in vertical order, write 3 in hundreds place, 7 in tens place and 6 in units place, and write plus 2 in the units place. Now we will begin our addition from the units place. 6 plus 2 is 8, and in the tens place, we have 7, so we write 7 as it is, in the hundreds place, we have 3, so we write 3 as it is, so the answer is 378. Addition of 3 numbers. My brought an eraser, for 2 rupee, a pencil for 3 rupee, and some, colored chalks, for 4 rupees. How much should she pay the shopkeeper altogether? My bought an eraser for 2 rupees, pencil for 3 rupees, colored chalks for 4 rupees. Now, 2 plus 3 makes 5, and 5 plus 4 makes 9. Does, 2 rupees plus 3 rupees plus 4 rupees is equal to 9 rupees. So, my should give 9 rupees to the shopkeeper. Hope, you enjoyed this section, if you like this video, hit like button, and subscribe our channel and press bell icon to get daily notification of our channel, thank you, keep supporting me, cheers.